In the last video, we had a look at layering the loops from deck A and deck B. In this video, we'll further our look on layers. Previously, we looked at layering the complete loop from each deck on top of each other. Now we're going to take a look at how to layer individual marker regions. This could be handy if you want to have one marker from a loop in deck A trigger a marker region from a loop in deck B. So for in this example, I'm going to layer a natural snare drum marker in deck A to a synthetic snare drum marker from loop in deck B. To do this, I'll need to select my snare from the deck A's loop. I'll use the right mouse button to select and audition the marker regions to be sure I select the correct one. With the correct marker selected, I can then start to audition and select the marker regions from the loop in deck B that I wish to layer. Once they are both selected, from the options menu, select layer selections in both decks. The two marker regions will be layered so that both regions will be played at the same time from the same note. Another layer option is to layer all the marker regions that have the same name. So in my example, I have labeled the first marker in each loop in deck A and B to kick. Now when I select layer harmonious regions, each marker that was named kick will be layered together. These two ways of layering certain regions from a loop to regions of another allow great ways to create accents on certain beats of your loop. When you load up loops into both decks, by default the keys are mapped so that each marker region has its own note depending on which deck you have selected. By selecting assign both decks to whole keyboard from the options menu, each marker will have its own note regardless of which deck is selected. By selecting assign both decks to black and white keys, the markers from deck A will be placed on all the whole notes while markers from deck B will be placed on semitones, or the black keys. If you have mapped any layering between marker regions, this will remove them, so you'll need to remap the layerings again. <laughs> 